Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII. Now, off screen, I didn't do much, really. Um, I went to Timber to get the uh, Amnesia Scroll, or whatever it's called, to get rid of my mistake with Virgil, so, uh. But it is fixed now, so, hooray, hopefully. Uh, we'll see how things go. I may have to give him a new ability because he may have been overridden whatever ability he was going to learn, which kind of sucks, but hey. Um, I've also messed around with the junctioning a bit, so Agni and uh, Virgil and Shikyo are all on Quistus? Or self yeah, Quistus. That is uh, Ifrit, Carbuncle, Leviathan, and Tomberry. Squall has Nexus, Lilith, Sparta, and Ang, which are Ang. Which is uh, Shiva, Siren, Diablos, and Pandemonium. And Selfie has Hex, Dante, Fluffy, and Anderson, which is um, Quetzquadal, Ifrit, Cerberus, and Alexander. And I messed up a little bit. Agni and Urja is uh, brothers, not Ifrit. So yeah, they have all set up. I also got um, 100 drains for each character, and put that to their stats attacks. Hopefully. All of them, pretty much all of them have it, except for um, Selfie, who does not have stash junction abilities yet. So yeah, but onto the set. Today's set, we're going to be looking for the White Seed ship. I know exactly where it's at. I actually looked for it a few seconds ago. So I'll be able to go straight to it. This took me forever as a kid to find. Oop. And right there. That easy. It did tell me that it took me that long to get. We meet again. My name is Squall. We're seeds from Balam Garden. I'd like to speak to your leader. I'm in charge. Set your business. Depending on what you say, we may ask you to leave immediately. I want to see you alone. We posed no threat. Adia told us that you would be here. Adia? How? Adia is no longer under Sorceress Ultimitia's control. She's now our ally. So there's no reason for you to hide Alone's whereabouts from us. We won't take Alone back to protect her from Ultimitia. Thank you for coming, but we have no reason to believe you. Please leave. Tch! <laughs> Rude! Oi, dude, I have a letter! Get back here, you piece of crap. Well, long time no see, sir! Well, look who's here! Squall, how's it going? Can't believe you're here. Everyone doing good, sir? After you guys left, the Gabaldian buttheads came after us, and we barely escaped to this boat. I was sure we were goners, sir. Zone went nuts and was thinking about swimming across the sea to escape. Hey, it was a plan. All you were doing was whining like a big baby. We're gonna die, we're gonna die, and look who jumped in first. You, you dumb nuts. I'll see how those, how these wackos keep surviving. Yeah, that's a good point. So where's Renault? How, where, or how's Renault? Where is she? Renault fought with us against Adia. For some reason, she went unconscious after the fight. She's resting in the garden now. I don't know what happened. We couldn't protect her. I'm... I'm sorry. You son of a... <laughs> what'd I say? What'd I say, huh? I told you to take care of her. That nothing had happened to her. Scumbag, you pathetic lying scumbag. So come on, easy sir, easy. She's not dead, That's j they just don't know what's wrong with her, that's all. Ain't that right, sir? Squall will never give up on her. Am I right, sir? We came here to get alone because there's no new evil force. At, there's a new evil force after her. If we can get alone and Renault together, maybe we can get Renault back. Really, C Zone? I told you, sir. Renault's gonna be fine. She promised she would come back. We all have to be. Uh, we all have to free Timber together. Don't worry, sir. All right. But I'm gonna say it one more time. If something happens to Renault again. I swear. What are you going to do? I'm a mercenary. You get stomach cramps. Seriously. Okay, let's see here. There are a few things we can do. 
Uh, do, 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 where is it? Okay, so if you haven't gotten um, uh, Angel's card yet, you can get it from playing him. It can be card mod into 100 elixirs, which is beautiful. I think I've already done that. Timber Magazine. Hmm. Sorry, I'm reading something. <laughs> uh, we can get a card from him by giving him the girl's next door girl next door item if we have in our inventory. All right. It's kind of cool to watch. See, you hardly ever get a board with it, bored of it. And I buy a chip one little. All right. Hey, this girl's next door. How'd you get it? So, if we give it to him for free, we get the Shiva card, which is nice. Uh, it can be card, uh, card refined into 100 North Winds, which can be refined into Blizzard wing, uh, uh, Blizzagas, which is nice. Um, let's see here. We can sell it to him for 25,500 uh, 25, 25, gil. Or not. I'm just going to give it to him. So I want the Shiva card. So you're just, oh man, thanks. You're awesome. Here, I want you to have this. Name card, Shiva. So yeah, that's the entire point of that uh, that uh, that book, just to get the Shiva card. Let's take a look at it. There it is. It's not that bad card. Not great, but not bad. All right. So this will, this will probably be a short set. I have things I need to do later today. I apologize in advance for that. But we'll see how things go. Here. This is Mitchin's writing. She really gave this to you? You guys call her Mitchin too, huh? Yes, uh, ever since we were little. We were raised by Adia, too. It was difficult to fight against her, but we did. Fortunately, everything turned out well. Adia's no longer evil. She's back to her old self again, the kind matron we remember. Squall, thank you. No problem. We owe you and Balam Garden much. Yet you never come to help us when we need you. Even our slew is the same. Mitchin told us it hasn't changed since Seed was established. Alright. Get the holy, put the squall. Third Jeebus! So it says in the letter you're looking for a loan. I'm sorry, a loan's no longer here. Ugh, of course. Not gonna be that easy. Remember we picked you up from our uh, from your garden near Fisherman's Horizon Coast? Yeah. Hello. After that, we head east to, the, to get away, uh, get as far away as we could from Adia and Galbalia. For long, we encountered the Garbaldian fleet. They had a lot of ships. Obviously, they were searching for us. We should have been more careful. They pursued us in full force. I wonder if Squall and company stayed with uh, Adia and not go to Balam Garden. Would they be White Seeds as well? Luckily, we were able to escape, but then our ship, our ship broke down and we were stranded. And how did I pick up those two? There's no way we were going to get let the Cabaldians take a loan. 
Eventually, the Gabaldians caught up, caught up to us and we had no choice but to prepare for battle. Then a starship appeared. A battle began be, uh, between them, and we were, we were caught in the middle of it. Then something strange happened. What's that? Suddenly, an S-Star ship came up beside us, and the SO soldiers came aboard. They told us, uh, told us to get aboard their ship. It sounded like an order to evacuate. Of course we refused. We couldn't trust them just as we couldn't trust we didn't trust the Gabaldians. As the SO soldiers were trying to convince us, the battle became more intense. Soon they were forced to leave our ship. Such an intense battle in the background. As the as their ship was uh, as their ship was pulling away, alone yelled out something. Then all of a sudden she jumped onto their ship. It wasn't like her at all. To this day, I don't understand why she did that. After that, Estar's fleet withdrew from the battle and fled. After that, we, well, it's a long story. After our ship was, full, was, full, was fully repaired, we planned to go to Estar. Sorry, Skull, we couldn't protect her. So alone's an S-Star. We believe so. Alright. Have you decided on a destination? S-Star. Oh man. Xenophobic S-Star. The area's, the area's terrain is not really suited for flying the garden. Anyway, set a course for Estar. Yes. Roger. Okay, so. Let's re. Set the party. Let's see here. <clears throat> Recommendations from this guy's guide. Uh, go to the Kushbal Desert to fight Cactuars until Alexander learns meta level up. Now I'm good. Uh, we can go to Shimi Forest to get, or Shimi Village to get some Ultima spells. I'm good. Alright, we need... Oh, I see why I want med level up. Okay. <clears throat> There's a boss fight coming up. Not boss fight. A Guardian Force we can get soon. Uh, depending on how we do certain things. And we'll explain what it is in a second. I also want to get somewhere in land so I can see if, where med level up is on my list. Oh no, I'm stuck! No! How do we get out? Here? That's a rock. No! Gonna back on. Oh, there's an exit. That's not an exit. This is the exit. There we go. I have no clue where we need to go to, to continue the storyline, though, as far as I know. But I will tell you a few things that are important to, to um, get this unique Guardian Force. Because this is stuff I'm going to do off-screen because it's boring as hell to watch me grind this stuff. Okay. Med level up. Anderson, where are you at? Guardian Force. Anderson. 120! Oh, jeez, this is going to take a while. And we'll, keep, we'll have this slur instead of high magic refined. Okay. <clears throat> to get this Guardian Force. Let me make sure everything's fine. Yeah. So that Marcora's acting up. Alright, to get this Guardian Force, you need 
uh, three, well not three, but you need si um, three sets of six of three specific items. You need uh, six steel pipes, six remedy plus, which is where the magic, uh, the med, uh, we're finding on that. Med level up comes from, and six Marlboro tentacles. I believe I have the six steel pipes already, not four. I don't have any, I don't have remedy plus because they can only get those from med level up. And Marlboro tentacles. Where do I have? Where am I on that? Two. Lovely. That's gonna be fun. All right, I'm gonna teach you how to get these these items. Steel pipes are mugged from the Wendigo creatures. You can fight them um, in the same area that Lago we had Laguna's first stream, which is the um, uh, the area around Timber. So let me pull up the map to show that. So around this area here, you can find them there. You can mug, mug the steel pipes from them. Um, you can also use card mod on the Elastacoid cards. Each last card refines into one steel pipe. So let's see if I can let's see if I can do those. Oop. I think I have a few elastoids. I don't see any. Oh, there's one. That's how that works. Let me show the car off so you know what it looks like. So yeah, give you these and you can get those as well. They're fairly common in card games, but you'll probably have better luck getting them from uh, Windigos. Where is Steel Pipes? Alright, I need one more. That's, gonna, that's not going to be that hard to get. Um, where are we at? Remedy Plus is the easiest, assuming you come prepared. Send to buy 60 remedies from any shop, and they're pretty obvious where to find them. Um, do. Uh, then use le uh, med level up to turn them into re six remedy pluses. So, 60 remedies, sorry. 10 remedies equals one remedy plus. So you need 60 in total, which I have 100, I believe. Yep. Uh, not sure what remedy plus actually does, so. Marlboro's tentacles are the toughest because only marbles drop them. Um, that's the quickest mean to getting them. Also mugging them as well, or card modding marbles, which are really annoying to do. Um, just do... But the only place to encounter marbles currently is the Gardini Forest near Chocobo Sanctuary. We can take Chocobo to get there. Uh, you can also kill them to get Degenerator, which is another ability for Quistus. Uh, the encounter rate is fairly low, though. So if you want to do it the other way, you can just mo uh, card mod four Marlboro cards to get one Marlboro Tentacle. So, yeah. Um, we can get... Marlboros to cut to spawn near Esthar though. I'm gonna show you try to see if I can show you where it's at, the force that. Let's see here, there's this. Try to be a garden. This is around Esthar. I believe this area right here is the Chugabo forest area you need to go to. Yeah, pretty much. So Jeez, I actually might want to go do that right now. If I do that, it's going to be a 15, an 18 minute set, though. Let's see here. Steel pipes. I get that. Hmm. I'm trying to think how I want to do this. I know. I'm just going to fight a little bit of, uh,. A few windows show that off, and I'll be it for this set, unless I get it right away. Alright, who has Mug? There it is. Turn that off. Alright, let's see if we can find some, uh, Windigos. Nope! Get over there. Fisherman's Horizon. Okay, so, they said we could find them around where we had Laguna's Dream, which is in this area here. So over there. If 
that still is nice. Where are they called? I had the first Laguna Dream, yeah. Well, technically the first Laguna Dream was on the, uh, the ship. Or not the ship, the, uh, ooh, three more limits. The, um, train over here. So I'm not gonna get much from that. Start working on some of those level grinds up, too. If I have time, I'll show you the, uh, desert as well. Sort of a, pre a preparation thing. A preparation set. There we go. Oh, chew! Awesome! That's kind of, a uh, weird. Okay. I really hope Odin doesn't pop up when I, I come across a Wendigo. That suck. Oh, tentacles, nice. Quite a few of them too. We have a decent resistance to most uh, stats elements. Probably not that great. And are you dead yet? Jeez, you're sturdy. Earthquake, lovely. Ow. Rude. Jeez, I'm quick. I think it's because I, I it was able to increase his speed to that. Oh, now he's dead. Well, that was fun. Seven, eight, three, not bad for one fight. Angler and boost, awesome. I think I'm still flicking my stuff. Right force, and oop, that's hex. Yeah, that'll do. I don't anything specific to learn from him. Right, set around where we fought, or the first dream. More of you guys. Thought that's again. I knew it was gonna come up soon. Yeah, I'll just go to the forest show you guys and do stuff off screen. It's kind of boring. I'm a little OP for these guys, so. So I guess this is going to be this, the end of the set. I'm just showing you the map roughly where it's at. You do kind of should get Chocobo to get there, though. Fortunately, there is a Chocobo forest near there. Alright, let's pull this up. Alright, the forest, uh, the uh, desert's over in this area here. Or here. Basically, you go there, run, th run the desert, and you come across uh, Cactuars, which are basically high quit or high speed um monsters that are annoying to kill weak against water so put elemental water attack to that and um kill them quickly because they run away but they always drop a high amount of ap so it's a great ap grinding place for now but uh sorry for the short set and we only did one storyline thing um next set should be a little bit longer with a little more with more stuff going on but till then have a great day and i'll see you guys next week Bye-bye.